Mr. McMahon is putting a huge amount of pressure on me to make sure you don't go to WrestleMania. I told him, you're one of my top guys, and we can't do the show without you. Now, he didn't like that at all, so you better watch your back, player. I'm sorry if you had the impression that you had some time off, but that's, um, it's just not the case. You've got a no-disqualification match against a surprise opponent, so if I were you, I'd start getting ready. With the Royal Rumble behind us, we're just over two weeks away from no way out. This is Michael Cole here with JBL, and the controversy surrounding our champion continues. Yeah, Mr. McMahon seems to think he hasn't gotten his pound of flesh yet. And I don't think he's too happy about our general manager standing in his way. I'm not happy about it either. I hope he knows what he's doing. Mr. McMahon, with all due respect, it's not a good use of SmackDown's resources to use our superstars to pursue a personal vendetta. And as long as I'm making decisions that benefit this brand, we both know that I can't be removed from my position. Well, hold on there. I don't want to remove you. Quite the opposite, in fact. I want to reward you with an extended vacation until after WrestleMania. Fortunately, my daughter Stephanie is a former general manager. And I'm sure she'll fill in admirably until you return. Don't forget to write. I don't believe what we've just heard. Our general manager has been sent on an extended vacation and Stephanie McMahon is the interim GM. And now we're hearing that this is going to be a no disqualification non-title match against the champion. The only thing standing between this man and the McMahons was our general manager, and he's just been removed from the equation. If you thought things were bad for him before, you haven't seen anything yet. We are just minutes away from SmackDown action coming to you tonight from Anaheim, California. And have you ever seen a crowd more excited than this one here? Excited's not the word. These Anaheim fans can't wait to get going, and neither can I. That makes two of us, partner. Let's get this show on the road. There's the reversal. Wow, great reversal. maneuver in the works from that top turnbuckle. You know, there's something that's playing to the crowd. He's got him covered. It's so great seeing these superstars in competition here tonight. I had a feeling they are going to wind up against each other sooner or later. There were times when it seemed like it wasn't going to happen, but I can't tell you how glad I am that it did. That's for sure. You know, anytime you throw these kind of combustible elements into a match, you're guaranteed a great show. And that's exactly what we're seeing here tonight. Uh. <coughs> Rey Mysterio is so fast, so agile, and so talented, and he's proven that he's championship material. Sure, he was a champ. So much can go wrong from that top turnbuckle. This superstar is all fired up, and so is this competitor. On the mat, shoulders down. This could be it. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Now, 
Talk about adding insult to injury. And these fans love it. Yeah, but you gotta worry more about the injury and less about the insult. <laughs> He's building up a head of steam. Look out, here it comes, 619. I think these superstars are gonna keep it up until they've got literally <laughs> heard about this match I wasn't sure what to think but these superstars are blowing me away really as soon as I heard about it I expected a tremendous matchup and I haven't been disappointed I didn't say I'm not disappointed but I'll talk about getting stuck with you as a broadcast partner some other time wow listen to that chant the crowd makes a huge difference whether they're for you or against you Look at the fire in the eyes of the great Kali. He's here to make an impact. Yeah, well, that's not hard to do when you're a seven-foot monster. A lot of people think Rey Mysterio's really exciting to watch, but he just doesn't have the size nor the strength to compete at this level. He's got his opponent on the ropes. There he goes. Drop the dive, 619. How do you approach a match with someone like the great Kali? Well, part of the match is the one who's going to strike him. Oh, he's going for the cover. Somebody must have fallen asleep at the switch. Oh my God, do you see what I'm seeing? I see it, but I don't think he does. He sure sees it now. It might be the last thing he ever sees. He was screwed. Plain and simple. And he'll be lucky if that's the worst that happens to him before WrestleMania. be out of your bloody head if you think for one second I'd team with you against that monster. Don't embarrass yourself by asking again. Boy, I love to team up with you against that walking free show, but I've got other things to do, like keep breathing. Find some mother sucker, one who's preferably got a death wish. <laughs> that was a pretty funny joke asking me if I'd team up with you this week. You were joking, right? <laughs> I hear you're having trouble finding a partner, and that's just too bad. I mean, really, my heart bleeds for you. But if you can't find anyone, I'm just going to be forced to make it a handicap match. No Way Out is just over one week away. This is Michael Cole here with JBL, and for one superstar in particular, there may truly be no way out.
We all saw what happened last week, and that's just the beginning. The champ will be lucky to even survive until No Way Out. There's only one guy in the locker room who supports him. And how long do you think that's going to last? Tonight's main event could be one of the biggest matches in WWE history. What was that? Wake up, Ken. Wake up. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> The champion was supposed to have a tag team match tonight, but his partner, I don't even know where to begin. I don't even want to think about what happened to his partner. I'm going to have nightmares about that for weeks. Weighing 326 pounds, Kane! The word giant gets thrown around a lot, but the great Kali is the real deal. Dude, he sure is. I can't even begin to imagine where they found a monster like him. I don't know, but I wish I did, just so I could stay the hell away from there. You and me both, partner. I'm a little nervous just sitting this close to him. Talk about adding insult to injury. Ah. And these fans love it. Yeah, but you gotta worry more about the injury and less about the insult till the match is over. This is just dumb. You don't win a match hey. by taunting your opponent to death. I disagree. Getting the crowd on your side can be a huge psychological ah. boost. Look at him, he's just radiating confidence. And he's got a lot to be confident about. He looks a little overconfident to me. This could come back to bite him. He could pin his opponent right here. I thought these two were terrifying before, but seeing them this angry is something else entirely. They're frustrated that they didn't get to completely dismantle a champ, but it wasn't for lack of trying. I know that this is a rough business, but there are rules. You can't just end a superstar's career. Tell that to these guys. Better yet, tell that to Mr. McMahon. No thank you, I have no desire to make a target of myself. That's the smartest thing you've said all night, Michael. Of course, that's not saying much. Have you had enough yet? There's still time for you to just give up now and save yourself a world of pain. Don't be an idiot. Think of your career and not your pride.
I can't believe you were stupid enough to make that challenge, but I accept. Your championship will be on the line at No Way Out in a Hell in a Cell match. Get ready to be sent to hell by someone who's very familiar with the place. No way out is this Sunday. This is Michael Cole here with JBL, and we've just received word that the championship will be on the line at No Way Out in a Hell in a Cell match. And no one's more familiar with Hell in a Cell than the challenger. This is going to be a massacre. But before No Way Out, the champ has a challenge to survive tonight. Yeah, someone else wants a piece of the champ, and Stephanie McMahon's giving it to him. His friend was attacked backstage last week because he agreed to stand with the champion in what was supposed to be a tag team match. Yeah, and he's holding the champion responsible for it. Can't say as I blame him. match and then hell in a cell on Sunday. I'd hate to be the champ. That's the way to do it. Nothing like the sight of your own blood to take the fight out of you. I hope this is over soon. No matter how many times I see this, I just can't get used to it. What? You get a little squeamish? This ain't ballet, you know. He dodged that bullet. I've been looking forward to this match all night. So have I. It's certainly been one of the most anticipated matchups in recent weeks. And usually when you got that kind of hop, it's tough. Come on, quit showing off. This is a wrestling match, not a popularity contest. We've seen this before. He's been wrestling. This could be big, but it could backfire. This superstar is all firing up. Here's the pin. Night after night, the WWE superstars never fail to amaze the fans. That's a good thing. I don't even like to think about where we'd be if they... He's building up a head of steam. Look out, here it comes, 619. These superstars are so unpredictable. I'm having a hard time figuring out what's going on next. Rey Mysterio was so fast, so... The champ is absolutely livid, and it's not hard to see why. Yeah, yeah, wah, wah. He didn't want this kind of treatment. He shouldn't have betrayed Mr. McMahon. You know, I've been thinking about that, and I'm starting to wonder if the champ wasn't just a pass. You're not seriously making excuses for him, are you? You might as well kiss your job goodbye. I'm not saying anything one way or the other. I'm just thinking out loud. Yeah, well, thinking isn't your strong suit. Leave that to me.
almost feel bad for you. You're about to experience firsthand what happens when you cross the McMahon family. It's not a lesson that most people need to learn twice. Of all the superstars who have ever crossed me, I don't think I've hated any of them as much as I hate you. My only regret about what's about to happen is that I can only watch you be destroyed once. On the ride to the medical facility, I want you to remember that you brought all this upon yourself. Ladies and gentlemen, this is no way out. And tonight, our champion will be put through hell, literally. It's hell in a cell, and the championship is on the line. And there's no way the champ is coming in here at 100%. Will the champion defy the McMahons and retain his title? We'll find out. The word hot has been used to describe several superstars over the years, but no one deserves the name more than this man. He's no stranger to hell in or out of a cell, Michael, and hell is exactly what he's going to put the champion through tonight. It seems like the champion has been under constant assault for weeks. Frankly, I'm amazed that he's made it this far. Yeah, but let's face it. This has got to be the end of the line for him. He should accept that he's going to lose the title and try to just survive tonight. looking at the future of the WWE in this ring tonight. Wouldn't surprise me one bit. This is a great match. The fans are definitely into it. And that's what really matters. If the WWE fans aren't happy, they'll let you know it. These superstars have been giving them everything they've got all night. They sure have. And that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE superstars comes into play. Yeah, you're not going to win a match if you're blown up two minutes into it. You can say that again. I've seen matches won and lost simply because one superstar was able to outlast... Here it is. He's building up ahead of steam, and he's about <clears throat> to let his opponent have it. And he may get the three count right here. Right. You know, there's such a thing as playing to the crowd too much, and that's what I'm seeing here. I disagree. He's wrestled this match his way all along, and now we see it paying off. Look at this. Pandering to the crowd. Nothing wrong with keeping the paying customers happy while you build some momentum. These fans have got something they <laughs> He's got these fans on their feet. They know what's coming. There it is. A huge 6.9. I think these superstars are going to keep it up. Here's the pin. One, two, three. Night after night, the WWE superstars...
unbelievable. Somehow the champion has managed to retain the championship. This has got to be some kind of trick. I must be dreaming or something. It's no trick. He has achieved the impossible. He looked hell in the face and laughed. What's it going to take to bring this guy down? I'm not sure anything can at this point. The fans have tried their best. Don't underestimate the McMahons, Michael. They'll find a way. Well, if they want to stop them from headlining WrestleMania, they better come up with a plan quickly. Oh, they will, believe me. They'll pull out all of the stops now. I knew you could do it. I knew it. I only wish I could be there to congratulate you in person. But it looks like I'm going to have to watch from the sidelines a little longer. Good luck, champ.